Hi guys, my name is Morgan Aaliyah and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So, alright, this video was supposed to be like so many different things or whatever, like it was supposed to be a weekend in my life, a, a Sunday reset and then into like the first few days of the week but it was raining all like all of this weekend and i don't know i have like something against like recording when i'm in a bad mood so like there's like huge gaps in time so yeah it, something happened and i didn't want to record like i'm not gonna like fake around and be like smiling in the camera's face when i'm not actually gonna get a bad mood like I don't know, I feel like if I do that, then YouTube will like start to come like not as fun for me eventually. Like it'll just lead to that ultimately. And that's just not gonna happen. Um, so yeah, but this video is supposed to be like a, just the first part of the week vlog. Um, because the video that I'm filming right now is supposed to be going up today. But because I didn't record over the weekend, I just have to, you know, get something up still to stay consistent and stuff like that. So, here we are. Um, so, right now, I'm in the, well, I'm, like, on the first floor of the cafe, so I'm, like, on my way to breakfast. And then I'm going to head to class, so I'll see you when I get there. Classes and start till 10 is like literally right across the street right there. So I decided to like sit down, chill in this little beautiful scenic area. Why do I look like I'm doing an interview for nobody? Um, anyway, so today's plan you know, I don't really have one. Um, I have this first class, and then my second class that goes like literally like directly after it got canceled this morning so I have a huge gap in between this class right here and then my next class so I'm gonna have two classes today um this one starts at 10 and ends at 2.50 and then my second one starts at 2 and ends at 2.50 so yeah um I don't know what I'm gonna do with that huge chunk of time but we'll see um I know for like a little part of it I did want to like talk a little bit about like I don't know my my take on like the first month of college or whatever um just just to give some insight to my life um and then tomorrow let's look at my calendar really I just have a few like appointments for tomorrow and then I have like my modeling practice tomorrow so I'll probably record a little bit of that but um I don't know like for this week for just myself or whatever like I was just trying to um let me explain this better um so I have like a huge list of things that um I want to do or like things that I want to implement in my life and then of course um, I have my vision board on my wall so there's like just a lot of things that I want to do and get done and um, start working towards and so this week I'm kind of like trying to make my life that if that makes sense like I'm trying to implement the thing like this week just as like a tester I guess um, I'm just trying to implement those things so I know what works best for me and those just things, you know? But yeah, hopefully I will have a little bit more content, something, entertain something for y'all to, you know, watch. But I know other than those two things, um, 
I'm going to the gym today <laughs> and you know I'm trying to do that like the entirety of the week because I don't know like I go but then I slack off and then that's just it's a slippery slope from there so I'm gonna go try to go all this week even though it's supposed to be raining today at that time that I go um but yeah so I don't know I'm kind of proud of myself. This is like the first time that I've like had people like walking by and I haven't like totally chickened out from filming. But um, hopefully I will have some like more, I don't know, confidence in myself to do that. Um, but for now, like since I have this chunk of time, it's like about 20 minutes now because I've been talking for five minutes. But, um, a little over 20 minutes. So I'm probably going to read my book for a little bit. And then I'm going to head to class like 10 minutes before or 5 minutes before. Since it's right there. So, I'll see you then. in the background so yeah just know so I can hear at least but um I know that now so um I guess I just wanted to kind of like I don't know where to start like I have brainstormed what I was going to say about like five, ten times, and I've said the same thing over and over again. But now that I'm recording, never mind. I remember what I was gonna say. Um, so, um, yeah, let me take that off. But, um, I guess I kind of want to start with like the one thing that like. I feel like everybody says when you're going to college that like I think is true is that college is really what you make it I guess like since I've gotten here I don't know I had like a certain like predetermined assumption about what I thought college was going to be like or like the opportunities that I was gonna have but you know like a lot of the things that I thought what happened did still happen or whatever. I just didn't engage as much as I thought. But like stuff like the fall kickoff in my last video, like I think, you know, that's something that kind of, who is slamming the door like that? Um, but actually I know who it is. Yeah. But anyways, um, yeah, like that's something that you kind of like have always seen or like you always see somewhere in a movie or in a show or something like there's always that um, like event that I'm getting a call. <laughs> Um, 
I realized that I literally like haven't recorded since lunch or whatever. So clearly, as you can see, I'm in the gym right now. So I got back from my two o'clock class. Like, don't worry about that talk. We're gonna have it. Like, I'm gonna do it later tonight or whenever I have the chance to. But we're gonna get back to that topic. Don't worry. But um, I don't think I'm gonna record my whole entire workout today. I might, might not. Even if I do, I'm probably not gonna like include it all in the video. But today is app day, I think. So that's why I'm in the studio right now. Um, I might do some arms because last week I uh, came here but then I skipped out on it. dorm now or whatever um i've been here like for a little while now but like i let me reset okay um so after the gym um i went to travel smoothie i got here the long behind walk and i like halfway through i realized that i didn't go where all the other places i need to go there's a little grocery store on like that side of campus near the gym and stuff like that and like halfway all the way back here, I realized I didn't go. But anyways, um, so I've been here for like a little while. I'm gonna say like 30 minutes, but I still haven't, I'm not gonna lie. I did take a bite out of it, but I still haven't even eaten my food. But yeah, I did go to Chapel Smoothie. I got the, the Baja something and it's good. I just wanted to like get back into the conversation because I got interrupted or I like got on the phone like and then I think the last time I filmed before I went to the gym was at, I don't I don't know but yeah so as promised I did say that I was gonna come back and talk about it um so what was I even saying I was talking about my take on the college experience as in like from my first month here but yeah so I think the last thing I was saying was that like Okay, so, um, I just really learned that it's just imperative that you get involved. I think, like, my ex experience is kind of, like, a little self-sabotage or whatever. But I think since COVID happened and those, like, two years, I really just isolated myself. I lost, like, all social skills. Unless somebody else is, like, supplying, like, majority of the topics and stuff I can just respond and I'm fine and I if I'm like interested in the topic and I have more to say about it then there goes the conversation but I can't really form one myself and so it's just like really it's really hard to like find your people if you're not especially if you're not like from the place like I'm in North Carolina I'm from South Carolina so it's just like I don't know, I'm like, new place, new people, just t entirely new slate. Like, there's no, like, safe spot for you. Like, there's no, like, home base, except 
right in your side of the bedroom. It's just not what I expected. I don't know, I didn't expect like Teen Beach Movie or High School Musical, but in college or something, but I don't know. I expected there'd be some more excitement with like a automatic new version of myself or something like that, but like it really is what you make it. Like you have to put in the work to do all that. I think like in high school or whatever, you can kind of like avoid a lot of like the things that you have to deal with especially yourself and stuff because your days are like literally so structured you go to school between this hour and this hour you're always doing something or whatever um and then you go home you chill out you mess around and you don't do your homework and then you go to sleep or you scroll on tiktok until 3 a.m and then you go to sleep and so it's like when you get here and you're experiencing this and you have all this time on your hands you really have to like learn to like sit with yourself and just be you and send your own thoughts and all of that and so it's just like i don't know it's a different it's a, literally just a different experience or whatever and so a uh, learning experience i guess i learned a lot of things about myself and definitely like things that i have to fix um or just implement in my life and stuff like that like I know I talked about it a little bit earlier today but like um from my last video like you only saw my vision board but I just put this up um a list of things that like I have that I want to do or whatever or things that I want to implement in my life I don't know you really just have to find what makes you you um you like you can't really like just kind of slide into somebody else's group or personality or whatever and just like kind of cling on to that and make that what you're yours to like what's yours to survive or whatever like something that i realize is very different from high school or whatever is like that you can easily find your situational friends or whatever they're in your class and y'all are going through the same stages of your life and stuff like that and i mean you're doing that here in college as well but like this is such a bigger range of people or whatever so you really have to find your space and there's just a level of comfortability that comes with being in your like own place like your hometown so if i was in south carolina and I was just at college or it just be a little bit different because I'm still in a familiar place but uh, when you're coming out of state something I really didn't expect was just like feeling like so like just alone like I wanted to get out the house so bad like I for the longest amount of time and I got here and I was like I kind of want to go back home as much as I hate to admit that I mean I love here i love the campus i love the area or whatever and i love i do like being away from home but um as much as you think that you won't get homesick you probably will at some point like it's just inevitable um, let me think up five yeah five tips or five things that i have to say about my take on the college experience um or so far in my first month one find your people i joined the african student union i joined bsu um i got into a modeling group that is kind of intertwined with asu um so that's just like kind of a start but um like outside of that i really haven't done much or whatever like i have a few people that i just kind of say hi to because they're in my class and stuff like that but like you have to work hard to like find those people second thing hmm save some money go ahead and do that um the broke college student thing is is true like i don't why didn't i save more money than i did like everybody knows like broke college student or whatever you eating ramen in your room or whatever no i don't need ramen but um i have a meal plan at least but um definitely save money because you know i didn't go back to school shopping it's not like regular stuff because literally you have to pay for every single thing 
you all the things that you don't expect to need number three mm, you know what let me give a little hope to the relationship people the people who are in relationships and you're about to go to college it can work if you want it to relationships in college can work if you really try it, and it's really not that hard if you really feel for that person but if you really don't then um sorry to break it to you <laughs> then in that case listen to the people that you see literally all the time go ahead and pick up oh just something to know professors are 10 times less intimidating anybody anybody who has told you about college like as like adults telling a child about college and stuff like that like oh they're super hard on you and this and they're they're hard on you in the places that make sense like what you do on your own time is your responsibility if you're not going to do your homework on your time that's your responsibility cool but i'm gonna let you know as a professor i'm gonna let you know like be in my class or you're not gonna pass or you can only be absent for two days before you are dropped out of my class or something like that. It's strict in that way, but as far as like them as people, they're just normal people and they're a lot less tense and stuff like that than a high school teacher would be and stuff like that. So, I mean, they're not really intimidating at all. Like, you, you are equals. I mean, I guess it depends on whatever college you're at, but I feel like that's kind of universal in some cases. I mean, there might be some hard teachers, but, or strict teachers, but, I mean, as expected, there's always, like, that one teacher that you have that is just, like, doing too much. Um, but, yeah, that's, I don't know how many that is. I don't know how many I said. Um, what else? Ah, another thing, studying. Um, class is not structured as you would think. It's not like worksheets in this and that third. You're either like just being talked to or you're taking notes or you're, yeah, you're just being talked to or taught and stuff like that. And so most of your things will be like online and stuff like that. If you have Blackboard, Blackboard on my campus has Canvas. Um, but I mean, Tests aren't in class, like they're on your own time, mostly open book or whatever. But don't don't let that fool you when, I mean, of course I haven't taken an exam yet, but like just seeing how it's structured, it's really all on you. Because if you can, you can, anybody can sit there and take the notes in class, but if you don't put in the work to like actually learn the information, then you're just, I don't, no, you can't like I I can kind of feel it like you can just kind of sense that you can't really just um, kind of sit back and let it flow and kind of just wing it and stuff like that because the tests matter less than the exam does if we're being honest here because the test most of the time you can just do an open book or I mean teachers already know like if the, you know they say oh it's not open book but they're but you're doing it out of class they already know that you're gonna finish, that you're gonna use the notes and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um. But yeah, that's everything that I have to say for now. So, thank you for listening to this long segment. I just know it's gonna be long. Like I've been talking for 20 minutes straight. So, um, I don't know how I'm gonna cut this, but um. I'm probably not gonna have much else to record tonight so except for I'm literally probably just gonna watch a movie and go to bed maybe do some homework <laughs> um so most likely I'll see you guys tomorrow bye Sherman High School Sherman Illinois 60062、Hey、guys and welcome to day two of this vlog so so far um i went to breakfast and um i went to my first class it's 11 06 right now 
Let me just check. Yeah, it's 11 06 right now. Um, so I just came, I really came back to um, just get a jacket because it's cold. But um, I mean, I don't really have any else, anything else to do except edit. I was editing during my class a little bit, but I really am trying to get this out by tomorrow. So um, I might edit a little bit more while I'm in here. Um, I have a meeting or a conference with my teacher at one through Zoom. So, and then I have the same class with him at two. So I'm not really sure if I'm gonna go to lunch or anything. I'm probably just literally gonna stay in here. And then um, after that class, then um, I'll go to the gym and stuff like that. I feel like today was gonna be like more eventful, but we'll see what the day is looking like. Um, and yeah, so obviously I can't record me um, editing and stuff like that. But I just wanted to, you know, you know, what's the word I'm looking for? I just want to formally kind of uh, introduce the day, I guess. Um, that's like the best I can think of right now. But um, yeah. I just not just I've been here for like a hot minute maybe not more than 10 minutes but um, I got back from the Kaplan Center and then I went and stopped by the store I think I recorded a little bit of that but right now I have a little time on my hands I don't have uh, my modeling practice until 715 so I have to leave probably like 655 just to like be able to walk there and not be rushing and stuff like that um since i have stuff to put in the um refrigerator i'm gonna clean it out like again and then i'm gonna probably start editing until it's time for me to go to modern person i'll probably record that and then that'll probably be the end of the video but yeah so let me let me get started i'm probably gonna clean my room up a little too just to like it's just nice to have a clean space sometimes so not so all the time so
Thank <laughs> you.